hey welcome to my channel and welcome back if you are already a subscriber if you're not I would love if you would hit the subscribe button below give me a thumbs up if you like this video today without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into this huge Dollar Tree haul I picked up a ton of new items at the Dollar Tree and I'm super excited to share that with you today so I picked up some more cleaning supplies and you know Dollar Tree has some great great things for cleaning and I had already picked up some of the other uh, floor cleaning products well they are like more on the rough side so they clean really well in the kitchen and then there's another uh, like I think it's supposed to be like a medium medium strength or something for cleaning I don't know but anyhow I don't even know what I'm talking about right now but I wanted to show you this one that I got um, yesterday and this one is like super soft and fuzzy so it's a good floor duster for your wood floors and there's that and I also picked up this um, multi-purpose cleaning cloths there's two of them and these are really good for the counters so I will um, let you know how these ones work out because I bought some other ones similar to these so just some good cleaning products getting that out of the way first and let's go ahead and just move on to kids things kids toys I got this adorable Elmo toy it's for to oh, no sorry 18 months to four years and it's by play school super cute Elmo and then I also got, um, who is this one? Or, I don't know. Is that the Cookie Monster? Okay. I should know my Sesame Street characters with all the kids I've had. But anyhow, you will tell me who that is, I'm sure. So those are really cute collectibles. Um, I, the other day I had um, got these LED projections, uh, projectors. I went back and bought another one of the dinosaurs because I thought that one was so nice. And yeah, these are just so cute for kids. So I got another one of those because I thought that was a good deal. And then I also picked up these uh, easy to read books that are um, peanuts. So I got this one. This is for school or time for school, Charlie Brown. Yeah, those are nice. And I don't know what these say what level they are. Probably do somewhere. I don't see it on there. But anyhow, I got that one. And then I also got Lucy Knows Best. <laughs> and that one's really, really cute. And I'm actually going to give that to someone named Lucy. So I got those. Okay. Just a couple of random items. I picked up one of these candle snuffers. Is that what you call them? Yeah, candle snuffer in this copper. And they had it in, I think, black and gold as well. Do I have it turned the right way? Well, here's the right way. But yeah, this will be nice um, to put your candles out. That way you don't have smoke going everywhere. Okay, the other item that I picked up or items are these beautiful coffee mugs. I've been wanting some glass clear coffee mugs for a while and so they're rather big which is perfect but it's kind of cool to be drinking your coffee in these and I think if you're doing any type of coffee drinks and you're trying to look fancy this is it. So I just picked up two of those because I have so many coffee mugs but I wanted to get two. The next items that I'm going to go through are planner supplies and I was looking for these because I saw them in another haul so these uh, little cards I'm not really sure what they are yet um, because I'm not an experienced planner but um, they said they're supposed to be used planners and I'm gonna probably just open one of them up here after I show them to you and they look really pretty so let's open one up and see what's inside. I think what you're supposed to do is just, you know, insert them into your planner. You can write notes on them. And then, so they have these, uh, 
lined side of the card and then on the other side it says the good life and it's a really pretty embossed print so yeah I don't know a whole lot about that but there's just there's a whole bunch of different ones and I'm not going to go through all of them but there's just a few so what does that one say do you guys hear that wind is that crazy it says live it up okay anyhow like I said I don't want to waste too much time going through all of them but those look really cute and I'll let you know what I do with them see how pretty these are okay so that's that and I picked up two packages like you saw of that and then I picked up three packages of these because I am sharing some with my daughter for her birthday she won't know because this video is going to be posted after but these are the same thing there it just says cards and yeah so there's a print like that on the back and then they have things on the front i can't read what that says on here a crazy adventure that's what it says and then you have these little cards again so yeah those are really cute i got three of those and then i also found these uh stickers for your planner and this one looks really like rustic, kind of a uh, farmhousey boho. I don't know what you call that. And then it has different stickers on the other side. So that's one. And then here's another one. And this one is very spring. Very spring. And I got multiples of these as well so that I could share them. Oh, look at these ones for like love and kind of Valentine's, parrots, petty. Those ones are really cute. Okay, I said I was going to stay away from that word cute, but it's not happening. So there's that. And then there is this one, which is very sweet inspired it's got some cupcakes and coffee and just yeah and then some on the back so make sure you grab those and uh these ones are jot and they were in the stationary aisle so check the stationary aisle now uh, moving on, I guess I'll go to home decor, even though this is really going to be an upcycle or used for something else, although it is pretty. I love these long signs though, and I saw some really good hacks that other YouTubers were using with these. So I'm going to be exploring that because this can be used as a small shelf for spices, and I may put that in my spice cabinet if it'll, if it'll fit. And just leave it this color because it's a pretty color and it still goes along with uh, my peachy blush pink tones that I have in my house. So, but if you want to use it as a sign as well, it would be beautiful in the spring. It says, I think I'll just be happy today. And it's, whoops, it's got this sunshine smiling on it. It's a really long sign. So I got that. And then I picked this up for DIY. It says bloom from within. And I thought that was so pretty. Now it is a wall decal, I think. Is it a wall decal? And I'll probably be using that maybe on some type of wood sign or something of that nature. So there's that. And I picked up another one of these in the home section where the storage and closet stuff is and I'm going to be using this on the side of my metal cart that I bought at Ikea for my uh, craft room and it can hold uh, different things on the side like hang scissors or um, wire cutters any kind of tools that you could probably hang would go good on here so I got another one of those and I got some of these command hooks because I mean, they're, they're command hooks, 
for a dollar and they are rather expensive in uh, at other stores and I'm gonna be using those on a project that is very simple that I heard about yesterday from do it on a dimes Catherine and uh, you just hook these underneath your desk with one of those wire baskets and I will link that video below as well but um, it's just to keep all of your cords and stuff out of the way it's a genius hack so these okay these are actually just regular twisted um, poly rope but I have an idea to use these in um, a DIY project that I'm doing and I'll show more about that later um, I also picked up these chalk pens chalk markers yeah chalk writers from the crafter craft wait is this crafters corner now this just says craft decor but I didn't have this green or blue and I did not have this pink in these particular ones I have other another brand so but I had the white one and I like it still can't find the black one but these are nice for a dollar again Michaels is these and they're not a dollar so there's those oh my gosh I'm so excited about this next product you guys wait to see this or if you haven't already seen it because I haven't seen it so for me it's just a big huge ah, moment okay these are fabric roses but they're made from burlap burlap who does not love burlap and look at these gorgeous gorgeous roses I want to open this so that you can see what it looks like so pretty look at these aren't those beautiful and it comes with four in a bag for a dollar okay and then there's also these uh, natural burlap I am completely stoked about this yes pumped up and ready to be I buy okay moving on but really really happy about that um, picked up one of these cute little frames with the galvanized background and the little clip for a picture and I'm not sure if I'm just going to keep this the way it is or paint the frame stain the frame I don't know uh distress the frame I might do that because I'm kind of loving the distress thing and so there's that yes and um okay this is so cute you can personalize it it's the ceramic little stand sign and you can just take one of your paint pens and I am personalizing it for my daughter for her birthday. I have decorated and I will try to show you guys that in this video. But it looks really cute in here. And um, I'm super excited about her birthday dinner and her giving her all her gifts that I've been picking up. And so I'm gonna use that. I know that these are supposed to be used for candy, but I'm absolutely gonna use them for, cause I already have really cute candy dishes, but these would be great for a party. And they're obviously in the party section, like closer to where you'll find like some of the wedding uh, plates, bowls, cups, all that stuff, all those clear items. But you know, I thought these were really nice for storing uh, my craft supplies. Just because I love to be able to see what is in something and they're also really nice to put within a larger uh like storage bin or something like maybe you could do i wanted to show you an example even though this acrylic bin is from um, five below but you know you can fit let's see can we fit three in here no not that way we can't or you know you can just place these on shelves but I went ahead and bought four of those here are my Hobby Lobby items that I picked up yesterday and I'm gonna start with the ones that I'm most happy about 
these are the most beautiful beads and I'm going to start with these really glam, gorgeous, pink, gold, pearl. Look at those. Look at these, y'all. Are those not just absolutely gorgeous? But these ones were really beautiful, too, and I loved these different colors. And like I said, these were all 50% off. They are 50% off right now at Hobby Lobby. I don't know if that is uh, the same everywhere or if it's uh, sales or local. I don't know. But check it out. Go on their website. And um, the brand is Bead Design Co. Company. And then there's the white ones I picked up. And these ones look more like they're very matte and they're wood. And those ones were $6.99 as well. So I only paid $3.50 for those. So I got I got some nice beads. Um I also picked up these. Okay, these are adorable. They are vintage Valentine's ornaments. I guess that's probably what they're called. Look at that. These Valentine uh dolls, girls. They were probably on Valentine's back in the 50s, I would assume. I don't know, because this looks really old. But I thought they were beautiful. Um, so that was a good deal. And then I also picked this up because I thought it was so cute. So this one says kiss, and it's, it's a wall sign, but I'm going to put it onto something else. And I got these little floral picks of the hearts. And I believe those were $2.99, so they were $1.79. Yep. Score. Aren't they cute with that pink gingham? Okay. And so these weren't on sale, but I was worried that I wouldn't get it because they're already putting them out. But look at this little Easter, pink Easter vintage truck. And it lights up. How cute, how cute. I'm gonna say cute, okay? Because this is cute. Put that over here so it doesn't get broke. And, okay, we could not leave without this, this little bunny gnome. Look at him. Love at first sight for me with this pink hat. Love bunnies. That wind. I know you guys can hear that wind. And he's got some carrots in his hand. I, he is so adorable. Okay, so there's that. Is that it? Oh, no, one last thing from Hobby Lobby, these little taco holders. And they're in the spring collection. And yeah, taco holders. That's exactly what they are. They had a lot of cute taco Tuesday. I call it taco Tuesday stuff. They had guac guacamole holders and or, or bowls. And they had big trays. And they had the red chili peppers on all kinds of stuff. And that was all on sale as well. And it was 40% off too. Hobby Lobby is popping off right now, so hit Hobby Lobby up. Okay, I only spent $22 in Daiso, and I got all of these things. These things are bestseller, and they are stained glass window clings. So I thought that was interesting, and they're really big, so I bought two of them. And at Daiso, if there's not a price on it, it's $1.50. So these were $1.50. Score. Got those. Grab this clear storage container. Love it in the pink color. $1.50. I think everything I bought was $1.50. But yeah, it's got, I, I love these lids. And I don't know if it's going to go in the fridge 
or if it's going to go, I, my idea was it would go for a craft organization. And look at this for $1.50. It's a little teacup with a, you know what, I'm not even sure what's in here. Yeah, so it is this. What's, okay, let's see. I thought there was a plate under here. There is! Oh my gosh. For $1.50. How unbelievably adorable is that? It's very little. You could do some espresso in this. You could do some maybe like Chinese tea because they use the smaller ones. I don't know, but I'm in love with this. I could not resist. I had two of them. They were the last two and I should have taken the other one because now that I see it out, I'm very sad that I, and it comes in this cute box too with this like red checkered print. So very Valentine's-esque. I grabbed this, uh, what do you call this? Oh, you don't know what Daiso would to call it. It says makeover sheet, but it has that really pretty, you know, uh, like European tile print on it. And I'm really liking that. I don't know if I'm gonna put it in a drawer, if I'll put it on a DIY, I don't know, but maybe even on the wall. And I got this for a DIY. So I'll be painting over that. I'm not going to be keeping the marble. But yeah, and you'll see that one coming up. It's just a little wastebasket. $1.50. This was in the garden section. This little cute picnic table made from wood. Real wood. And I have some ideas for that. And this is supposed to be like one of those little plant stands and I don't think that's what I'm going to use it for because look at this it's got this pretty flower on it like daisy yeah so I'm probably going to use that for a DIY and this very last item I'm so excited about these little milk bottles I'm going to do this DIY that you uh, make them look like they have milk in them I got three and then I found this, which I'm going to paint, this little wood crate that has a spot for three bottles that fit perfectly. Look at this. And I just need to get some straws. Maybe not. I don't know. And I have these labels that I'm going to put on there. You'll see that this is going to be adorable. I can't wait to do this one. So you guys, that's it. Um, like that's not enough, but check these stores out because that was like $22 for all that stuff I got at Daiso and at um, Hobby Lobby I think I only spent like 28 or something Dollar Tree's were where I really kind of spent too much but such is my life it was great having you here with me today I hope that you will uh, come back and please comment below and let me know what projects you're working on for spring uh, we've talked a lot about Valentine's, so share something with me about spring. And I hope that you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. And I will see you soon in another video.